Department of Education Building Maintenance Supervisor Billy Cruz received a call at 6 this morning saying that Simon Sanchez High School was broken into. He says the main building of the campus was hit between 10 p.m. last night and 6 a.m. this morning. Dented desks, spray-painted computer screens and trashed rooms were just some of the damages being assessed. Cruz notes it's hard to determine what was stolen, but he estimates the break-in damage cost between five to ten thousand dollars. What was reported to me is a lot of doors that were damaged. Uh, they were broken through the backside of the gymnasium and worked their way into the main building and damaged all the office uh, doors. Uh, major uh, vandalism, practically just vandalism. Cruz adds he will be talking to the acting superintendent to get more funding for security measures, not just at Simon Sanchez, but for all schools for the 2012 fiscal year. Principal Beth Paris says the bail schedule was altered so classes could continue, but no students were allowed into the main building. She adds the person or persons who broke into the office also broke into their key box and went into over 40 classrooms. Teachers also still need to do a floor assessment, but some TVs and laptops were stolen. Paris says yesterday was a great day for their students and the school was looking good. She just questions why this is all happening. To find out that we were vandalized, I think, um, really puts us in a situation where we're kind of wondering why. Why is our school being hit? Um, and so, you know, it's, it's such an unfortunate, well, it's such an unfortunate situation that, you know, we plead to the community. Um, if there's anyone that has information uh, regarding the individuals that are involved, please contact GPD and let them know.